He says, supermassive black holes at the heart of galaxies hold the key to understanding how galaxies become uh, come into being. Maybe. Yes. Maybe. Can, let it, me tell you why it's a maybe. Okay. Because the supermassive black hole has like the big ones, like a billion solar masses. So the mass of a galaxy, however, is hundreds of billions times the mass of the sun. So maybe the black hole nucleated some things to begin with, but the mass of the galaxy swamps the, the mass, mass of the of black, black hole. hole. So right. there's a limit to how much you're going to credit the black hole for the whole damn, the, the kit and the caboodle. Gotcha. Okay. That that makes, so continue. That's a, good, that's a very good yeah. point. He says, um, is it fair to say that entire galaxies will inevitably end up being swallowed by their own black holes and disappear forever. No. No. Yep. There you go. <laughs> thank no, you no, no. for being my everyday source of wonder. Oh, thank you. I love that. So here's the thing. A black hole is really tiny relative to the galaxy. They're big. They're like the si the billion solar mass black holes are like multiples of the size of the solar system. But that's still tiny Compared in the middle to of the, the galaxy. galaxy. Okay. Right. 